Welcome to the behind the scenes making of video for One Take Movies. Uh, my name is Ryan Hunter, I directed these videos. I'm John Bershad, one of the co-creators and co-writers of the episode. I also play the son at the end. I'm Avery, this is One Take Movies. I was an actor in it. You'll see that I'm the boy, our faces are the same. Uh, I also wrote it with John Bershad. I made a lot of the props. Uh, my girlfriend will tell you, I spent a lot of time on them when I should have been paying attention to her. This one was the first one that we shot. We had no idea how we were gonna do it and we barely did do it. This one, it was, re this one was really hard. Um, that, it was really hard. Let's watch it and I'll tell you some things about it. Oh, there I am. Look at me, looking up at the heavens. Here we begin with uh, Avery and Morgan uh, pretending to be lying down in a field and actually standing up. That is the easiest trick that is going to be in the video. Okay, so that asteroid was made out of a large styrofoam ball that I, that I cut out and shaved. Okay, so this sequence with the phones is a great idea in theory. When you realize it involves four actors and four people in black bodysuits manipulating vinyl backdrops behind them. Those things were surprisingly heavy. So this was the first of many awful things we made our helpers do. They were not able to see where they were going a lot of the time. There's so many people scurrying around in the background trying not to bump into each other uh, and bump into everything else. The script called for the president to be talking on the phone uh, and for the camera to pull out revealing that the president was on a television screen, which we pull out and reveal is sitting inside an electronics store. Actually doing that involved the TV prop and the electronics store prop being sort of around the camera lens for the entire beginning of the shoot. So when we're whipping back and forth to see the asteroid and back, the person holding those frames around the camera has to move with the camera. That uh, newspaper has a very hilarious fake article that I thought would be able to be visible if you paused it, but it's absolutely not, so you'll never know the very funny things I wasted time writing. <laughs> Uh, here's Rob Cuthill talking to Avery and, and, and Morgan Jarrett. This was the only episode that involved a 360 degree shoot. Um, when we were blocking it out, uh, at one point we needed to pan from one side of the set to the other, but that would have required panning across all of our lights and seeing our equipment. So what we did was we took a big black piece of foam core, punched a bunch of holes in it. And those lights are through the holes making the stars. And that's why that tiny rocket goes through like that. When I first read the script and I saw that there was a cat in it, I assumed that it was definitely not a living cat. It was a living cat. We didn't use him for almost all of the takes uh, leading up so that the actors would get their lines right and everybody would know what they were doing. We used a cat puppet as a stand-in and then we brought in the cat at the last minute and the cat was perfect. The cat was so calm and nice and I would say it made the video 30% funnier. This pregnancy belly was insane. We had no idea if that was gonna work. Basically we rented a nitrogen tank which was fed up Morgan's shirt during the shot. And somebody's job was just to carry that tank and unscrew it and let that belly inflate. Uh, I'll tell you, it was a loud, terrifying noise, and we really didn't want the balloon to pop and hurt her because she's so small and nice and we like her. Especially now that you're nine months pregnant. I think this one did. Yeah, just one. If, even if it doesn't seem big enough, just one. <laughs> the last line of the episode is, everything's going to be fine. Um, in between one of the takes, I remember saying how awful it would be if someone said like, everything's going to be great and ruin the take in the last line. And uh, the next uh, take, uh, uh, someone did that. I graduated college. Everything's, everything's going, going to be fine. fine. It was me, I did <laughs> I wasn't gonna name anyone, but it was Avery. We didn't use that take. 
To give you an idea of, of, of maybe how difficult these videos were to make, our, our very good friend uh, James McCarthy, I was talking to him, he created, was one of the creators of the great series Commentary On here on Above Average. And we talked to him, he asked how we were doing, and we said, well, we, we, we have to shoot the episodes about a month separate um, uh, because it takes so long to pre-production. And I said, how's your series going? And he said, pretty good. We, we shot the second season this weekend. Our DP, Kirk Larson, did an incredible job on this. Um, and he's just also a great guy, and uh, just a real sweetheart of a man, great body, uh, beautiful eyes. The MVP of this episode was definitely the cat. What a, a real sweetheart of a guy. After everybody knew exactly what they were gonna do, we brought in the cat. First time right out of the gate, a real pro, to tell you the truth. So we hope uh, that gave you a little more idea on how this episode was made. Uh, if you enjoy it, uh, uh, please watch more of our videos. Please share the episodes. Please share this video, because if it gets enough hits, maybe we'll make a behind the scenes of the behind the scenes. And wouldn't that be interesting? Thanks for, so much for watching the behind the scenes videos. We hope you learned something and uh, we hope you had fun. Houston, click to subscribe to Above Average. I love you. I'm sorry, over. I meant over. Shoot.